months ago when you were asked what's the biggest geopolitical threat facing America, you said Russia. The Russians were responsible for hacking the DNC. In the 1980s are now calling to ask for their foreign policy back. Their behavior has undermined international norms and international rules. You know, the Cold War has been over for 20 years. We're willing to stand up to Russia where they are deviating from our values and international norms. My last election, please. Yeah. Uh, After my election, I have more flexibility. Just as I told Russia to stop it. After all, you don't call Russia our number one enemy unless you're still stuck in a Cold War mind warp. The relationship between us and Russia has deteriorated. Uh, Russia has been uh, an ally. Vladimir Putin himself directed the covert cyber attacks against our electoral system. I think it's a it's somewhat dated. Governor Romney is mired in a Cold War mindset. Russia did engage in an effort to impact on the election. He acts like he thinks the Cold War is still on. That plays directly in the hands of Putin. But the preposterous notion that Russia is our number one political, geopolitical foe. Clear understanding of the degree to which Russia is engaged in this activity, the threat that it poses to the United States of America. Mitt Romney talks like he's only seen Russia by watching Rocky IV. Totally unacceptable and uh, dangerous this kind of behavior is. Russia is the most dangerous threat to the United States. Well, if you live in the 20th century, you might believe that. Soviets used to use somebody being a useful idiot. I think that Trump falls into that category. Yeah, yeah, I understand. I transmit this information to Vladimir. I understand what 